Hey guys, so it's Saturday morning. Um, we have to leave in about 15 minutes for Grayson's first soccer game of spring season. So here, I don't know how they do it in your area, but here where we live, there's a fall season and a spring season. You pay for both up front, and then if you don't want to do spring season, you can tell them you don't want to and they'll give you like 10 bucks back. Or um, you don't say anything and you just are automatically signed up for the spring season. So he has the same team, same coach, same place that he's playing soccer at. 45 minutes, only on Saturdays. Today is a crummy first day of soccer. It's supposed to be snowing and raining all day today. So it's going to be freezing, but we're going to go and we're going to enjoy it. So we'll see how he does. But... We are getting ready. Port's gonna stay here with Anthony because it is so, so cold. It's like in the 30s. I don't want Porter to freeze just to sit there and watch. And then hopefully Gray like runs around a lot and that'll keep him warm. I'm just gonna freeze sitting on the sidelines and hopefully I don't have to go out into the field with everyone. I hope I can just watch. We'll see how he does this time. But yes, we are about to leave. I did it! What do you got to say? Mm-hmm. So we are back from soccer. Grayson, did you have fun at soccer today? Yeah. Yeah, did you kick the ball? Yeah. And you did your toe taps, toe yeah. touches, toe taps, whatever. Yeah. And you did the snowballs? Yeah. And did you score a goal? Yeah. 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 And did you kick the ball and knock over the cones? Yeah. And what did you yell when you did that? Yeah. Yeah, so it was a pretty good first soccer practice game. I don't really know what to call it. What'd you do? Yeah, you did sit on your ball, huh? Grayson actually stayed out on the field like the whole time. He was actually really into it. He listened for the first like 30 minutes. And then I'd say the last 10 minutes. He was over it. He kept asking to go home. He kept sitting on the field and not wanting to participate. And his coach kept having to pick him up and he'd like run to where he's supposed to go and then he'd run right back to the middle of the field and then just like sit. So we're working on listening and participating the whole time. What are you doing? I'm glad that Anthony and Porter did not come because it was so cold. It kept changing between rain and snow, and at one point it was snowing and the snow was coming in sideways. The wind wasn't bad, which would have made it a lot worse, but man, it was cold. Um, I hope our next game is warmer because that was really, really cold and I did not enjoy that. Um, but it's over and we're back now. I'm trying to slowly start to clean and put things away for the party tomorrow. I have to go get the cake in two hours. Um, it's almost nap time and so that's when I'll be able to get a lot of cleaning done when the boys are sleeping or having quiet time in Gray's case. I wanted to keep you guys updated on the house. We went and saw a house yesterday and we liked it. We put an offer in on it. Don't know that we'll win it. It was towards our like the high end of our budget and so we couldn't go too high over asking price. Um, and so I'm thinking somebody's gonna go higher than us, but it's worth a try. So we put in an offer and offers are due by 8 p.m. tonight. So we'll probably know tonight if we want it or not, probably won't, but it's worth a try. So we'll see. Um, this will be the third offer that we've put in on a house. So um, is third time the charm? I don't know. Um, we like the house. It is big, um, 3,000 square feet, finished, half finished basement, storage, um, place it in the backyard for the kids. 
huge kitchen, big laundry room. So we'll see if we win it. It'd be awesome if we did, but we're realistic to the fact that there's a million people looking for houses right now and we probably won't win it. So just wanted to keep you guys updated. I will definitely let you know if we win it or not. Um, and I'm just gonna keep working on my house. I put Grayson to work and he helped spell this out. I helped like fix it, the spacing, cause it was like all up towards the top here. But yes, this is ready for tomorrow. I can't believe he's gonna be four. Saturday night fun. <laughs> hey guys, so we're just winding down the day. I already have Porter in bed. Grayson is doing a little iPad time before bedtime. Say hi, Gray. Hi, Gray. <laughs> Are you watching your iPad? Yeah. He's watching YouTube Kids. Um, it's been a very, it feels like a very long day. It's just been a day of trying to prep for this party, trying to declutter a little bit, clean a little bit. A lot of it's gonna come tomorrow. I'm saving like sweeping and mopping and vacuuming for tomorrow. I did go out and I picked up the cake that I ordered. I'll try to show it to you. It's in a box. I don't wanna take it out of the box till tomorrow. Um, but I'll show you what I can. So here's the cake. You'll see it better tomorrow, but it's just got letters all over it. And it says like A and Z and the number four. And then it says, oh, there it goes. Happy birthday. Oh, happy birthday, Grayson. Did they spell his name wrong? They did. <laughs> um, okay, I just realized they spelled his name wrong. Well then, okay, that was, that's interesting. I just realized they spelled his name wrong on the cake. Great. Okay, well, didn't realize that till just now. So I guess it is what it is. I specifically spelled his name in the email, so. Yeah, that's a bummer. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what to do about that. Anyway. <laughs> that like totally just threw me off. So as her name is spelled wrong on the cake, but the cake is here. And then I uh, well, also ordered uh, two dozen cookies. So here's the cookies, just ABC and the number four. So Anthony, rude, already ate one of the cookies. I told him, those are for the party. He's like, eh, I just wanted to taste one. So um, yeah, we've got the cake and we've got cookies and then um, I went to the grocery store and I got a meat and cheese tray and I got a veggie tray and then a fruit tray. So those are all ready to go too. I just have to pop them out. And then I've got um, chips and uh, my mom's gonna bring a chip and dip and a salad. We're gonna do pizza because it's easy and that's what Gray requested. So um, I think we're about ready for the party, except for just like cleaning up. And then I have decorations I wanna hang to. I'm trying to debate whether I wanna go to Party City or not. <clears throat> I think I do to get balloons. Um, it's just gonna be a little crunched for time tomorrow. But we'll see how it goes. I will try and record as much as I can tomorrow. I'm gonna be like running around with a chicken, like a chicken with its head cut off. I um, I always get so stressed and anxious on hosting birthday parties. I kind of wish I didn't have to do it. <laughs> I mean, I want my kids to have a birthday party, but it's a lot on me <laughs> to plan it and all and everything and have it go smoothly. Um, but so I'm always happy when it's over. <laughs> but it'll be good. Gray is very excited for everybody to come celebrate him. Yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this vlog. Um, I will see you guys in the next vlog. I still cannot believe they spelled his name wrong. I don't know if I should like contact the place. I mean, it's, it's kind of too late now. Um, they're closed on Sundays. So it's not, not like they could like fix it and I already paid for it. So I can't believe that. I should have looked at it more carefully when I picked it up. But even if I saw it, I don't know if I would have said anything because I'm so like shy like that. 
Okay, well, I will see you guys tomorrow for the party. Make sure to like and subscribe.